July 15th. See you then. We'll, we'll see you before then. Uh, join us because, and let's say this together. No! No! In the name of humanity. In the name of humanity. We refuse. We refuse. everybody for coming out. I stand here today, a veteran of these United States Armed Forces and a proud 21st century patriot. Yeah! I would like to take this opportunity to talk about this oppressive regime and the oppressive regime that constitutes capitalism as a whole. We are socialists, we are enemies of the capitalistic economic system for the exploitation of the economically weak. With its unfair salaries, with its unseemly evaluation of a human being according to wealth and property, instead of responsibility and performance. And we all, and we are all determined to destroy this system under all conditions. Benefit to the community precedes benefit to the individual. This state should retain supervision and each property owner should consider himself appointed by the state. It is his duty not to use his property against the interests of, all, of others among his own people. This is the crucial matter. This American nation will always retain its right to control the owners of property. A policy of lazy fair in this sphere is not only cruelty to the individual guiltless victims, but also to the nation as a whole. For there is one thing we must never forget. The majority can never replace the man. Life is like a mirror. If you frown at it, it frowns back. If you smile, it returns the greeting. Donald Trump seems to think that if you tell a big enough lie and tell it frequently enough, that it will be believed. It's not the truth that matters, but victory. The doom of a nation can be averted only by a storm of follow, storm, by a storm of flowing passion. But only those who are passionate themselves can arouse passion in others. Thank you. Just applauded Adolf Hitler. <laughs> 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 